Hi, welcome or welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time seeing my hands, hi, I'm Erin of Playing Life with Erin, and I'm so excited you decided to check out this video. Thank you for being here. And if you're returning, hey, hey, how have you been? All right, guys, we're going to plan on the Hobonichi Two Weeks. I feel like it's been forever since I've actually, like, planned in the Hobonichi Two Weeks, like, traditionally, like, well, not traditionally, but, like, the way I normally plan with my habit trackers and my to-do list and all the things. So we traveled to let's see we went to the Poconos um a couple weeks ago like um so I just used it for like a little to-do list and packing list that's what I ended up using it for and then the week that we got back I didn't use it at all and then last week I didn't use it again but I decided to make this cute little spread and I'm gonna show you guys how it came out I just did a little bit of journaling and just did my packing list no big deal but I was at stationary fest for um half the week and I didn't feel the need to make it into a to-do list or anything like that. This week, I don't have too much to do. I am not complaining. I am perfectly fine and happy with not having much to do. I feel like it's been a crazy couple of weeks. It has been, I've been traveling, I came home, like unpacked and then had a week and then packed up and went away to station fast. So I'm still catching my bearings. So a slow week is a, is a okay with me. Um, I think for this week though, what I'd like to do is I picked up a bunch of stickers from Stationery Fest. Ah. <clears throat> and I think I'm going to use some, one of these. I don't know. So I have these from, um, Everyday Explorers. Um, I don't know. I love, I love the colors of all of these stickers. So it's going to be really hard. I have those and then I have these from Cece's Art Cafe, which are so cute. I think I like, I kind of like the Postal Service one, like the Postal Cats. So I'm looking at like colors that I've pulled for the week already. Um, I could just do, that's kind of cute. Maybe we'll do this one. I don't know. Oh goodness. And then we have these. These are like teacups. They're so cute. I can't. And then like fountain pens and washi tape and journals. I think I want to use this one for a journaling spread. So. So far, this one, maybe. Um, these are so cute, too. Oh, my gosh. I think these might be too big. I got these from the artist of Yoseka. These are made by May. Um, so, so pretty. I like these. But I think I'm also going to save these for journaling. Okay, so I think we're going to go with these. Why not? Um, what else? Do I have anything else in here that I want to use? No. Okay. So we're going to use these. I'm going to pull in my... My grid washi, because why not? Um, I do have this washi that would probably be cute with it. Maybe we can add this in somewhere. Yeah. All right. I'm going to pull it. It's just like a, a script washi. I think I got this one from Timu. Um, and what color do I want to use? I could use gray. And I can use tan. Oh, my gosh. My cats have been chewing up my pen gaps. Poppy. She like, I think she's still teething. Okay, anyway, so there's that. It wasn't me. Um, or I could just like pull a pink. Let me see. What do I got? I've got this one. 772. That would probably look good. All right, we'll do gray and pink. Why not? And maybe we'll leave the brown out. Okay, so the way that I normally plan, let's get back to like a, an older one because I feel like it's been forever. Um, I use um, this section for a to-do list. I've been using this area for the weekend of, for my market list. And then I have like my tracker, um, my habit tracker and my mood tracker. Um, I do need, I don't know what I need. Where did I put them? I need habit trackers. So let's see. I think they're in here. Um, let's see. They're around here somewhere. Oh yeah. Oh, perfect. And I can use the gray ones. That works good. Or I could use gray and pink. This one's kind of like a muted pink. Um, let's see. Let's look at let's consult the stickers. This one's pretty and it does go kind of. I have darker gray or light gray. Let's do the darker gray. I'm not, I don't know about the pink. All right. Move this stuff off to the side. Okay. And then for my tools, I need my energel clima. And a ruler. 
Um, this is my 0 0.3. And I might bring in one of my fountain pens. I don't know. I just inked up um, my black one, I think. What's my black one? Oh, my goodness. I think this one is... Oh, no. This one is Muddy Swamp, I think. I gotta check. <laughs> I keep forgetting. And then this one is... Um, green at night. I'm using this one in my cousin. Um, and then I did ink up my um, Pilot Vanishing Point. Maybe I'll use that in here. I don't know. We'll see. Okay. We'll just see where this takes us. Okay. So let's do my lines first. So we'll do my high and low. I have not done a high and low in a while. It's crazy. Alright. Let's see. So I like to block off this section for a high and low. And then, I feel like it's been so long since I've like, done this. I don't have a very long to-do list, if anything. I have a few things that I wanna get done, like budgeting and things like that. Um, so I will, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna write out my to-dos and then I'll figure out where I'm gonna put my market list because I actually do need a few things at the market. Um, I've shopped quite lightly, I would say because um, we've just been traveling, so. And it's summertime, I haven't really felt like cooking. I've been, I said to Joe the other night, I'm like, I am like the worst wife ever because I am not performing my wife duties. <laughs> like, it's just been like fend for yourself for dinner kind of thing, like. Um, I was saying last night, like I always know what the kids are gonna have because they pretty much eat the same thing. Um, like almost every night, although they've gotten better, especially Weston. Um, but it just gets so hard trying to figure out what's for dinner. And Joe and I have been trying to eat healthy. Ah, hopefully I didn't just cut myself. Um, not that it makes it harder, but it kind of just trying to figure out what to eat. And then it's summertime, so I like to do a lot of grilling, but there's only so many hamburgers I can have. And speaking of hamburgers, that's what we're having for dinner tonight. Having little sliders because that's what I have, but I haven't had a hamburger since the Poconos, so I think it's okay. Oh my goodness, that's right. This washi, though very pretty, is very difficult because it's just wide washi. But I do want to like try to find like a meal plan. Oh, come on. Maybe we won't use this one. Let's try it one more time. I don't know what's going on over here. It's like something on it. What is that? I don't know what that was. All right. Might not be using this one, guys. All right. We did it. Yay. Okay. Now. How do I want to? I need just a space for, oh, and then I have my important things here. Okay, I added like a little section for important things. I don't think I need that. So let's do something like this. Ah, there we go piece there and then let's do a piece down here and then I'll kind of work everything in around it. Cute. All right. I just want to add a little something. I think I'm going to do my habit tracker here. Or not my habit tracker, my mood tracker. We'll do that like right in the center. So then I'll add in my habit tracker here and do I have something that I want to add in with it let's do that one here like that and these are so cute I'm so excited just use that there like that that's cute and then down here we can use maybe a mail truck yes and then this way we can cover up that other part oh I like it all right so for my high we'll do that in pink It is Monday. 
don't even know what the date is. The 12th. I, like I said, it's been a crazy couple of weeks. August has been a crazy month. I am not complaining because it's been a great month. This is kind of dark. I, hope, I mean, light. I hope it's showing up on camera. We had our family reunion at the end of July and the beginning of August. And then I went to Stationery Fest, which was pretty, pretty cool. <laughs> um, and I enjoyed that. Now I'm just kind of decompressing and trying to get back to life and all the things. What did I do with my pen? Here it is. All right. So maybe do I want to just work with this line? I wonder if I could do that. And then we can do, yeah, let's do that. Let's work with this line. I need my glasses and I don't remember where I put them. I had them because I wore them earlier. Oh, they're on, they're on my counter. Okay, I can see again. All right, so let's see. Let's do, I need a spot to write the day of the week. So pull that up just a little bit. And I use my Energel Clemo, my 0.3, because I don't like a really dark line. I feel like it's just like the right um, darkness. So I don't really particularly like pencil. Okay. All right, now we'll do, we'll start off in the center. We'll do just baseline and then anxious, happy. Um, mad and then tired. Okay. And then the days of the week. So let's do Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And I like to skip. Oh, I like to skip a line because um, sometimes I use the mood tracker to see if there's any type of pattern when uh, I'm getting migraine. And sometimes, some days, I start off where I am fine, and then other days where I'm not. Okay, I just wanted to take a little bit of that off so I could write mood tracker. All right. Cute so far. It feels good to be back planning in this planner this way. Kind of like this kitty down here. Let's do it there. Do I have any quotes? I don't know. I might have an according to Allie quote that I'd like to use. Let's see. Let's look. Um, home is where the people aren't going. Let's see. Summer. When was I today? Very hot. Do not recommend. Mm, I don't want to use those. Okay. Maybe we won't do a quote this time. I'm definitely having hot flashes. I cannot decide if I'm hot or cold today. I had the back door open for a while. Actually, you know what? Oh yeah. This one will look good up there. I had the back door open for a little while. Um, and then I got really warm. So I shut the back door and turned the air conditioner on. Then I was cold. Now I'm getting warm again. My body is just not happy. Mood tracker. And I think for here, what I want to track what, have I, what was I tracking? Working out in self-care. Um, I think we're going to stick with that because I've actually been really, really good with my water. I've been very proud of myself. Um, so I don't think I really need to do that. But let's track um, workouts and then self-care. Kind of like two different things. So like for self-care... I kind of want to stay with the momentum that I was away, especially with the Poconos trip, because that was like very nice. Like we did some, um, 
I did some reading. I kind of had some relaxed time. So I want to kind of stick with that momentum and keep up with my self-care and taking time to read and all that good stuff. So that's important. And then on the opposite side of things, <laughs> I haven't been working out. I think I said it in my my Hobonichi cousin um, plan with me video. Um, I wasn't really... <laughs> The only working out Joe and I really did was um, walking because I think we walked like, I don't know, some crazy amount of steps, like um, 15,000 and change or something like that. It was, it was crazy. Let's see if I want to tear this. Just so the, there we go. So this top part is... Oh, I don't want to block that off. So maybe we can do it like that. Okay, cool. And then we'll just trim the bottom. Um, so walking around Brooklyn and New York was was my exercise. Happy to say, though, I have not gained anything from either vacation. So that's good. Um, between all the stairs at the Poconos and then all the walking <laughs> in New York... We did not gain much, if anything. Cute. I love these stickers. They're so cute. Oh my goodness. Okay. Let's do, we've got a package there. Let's do a mail. Let's do this big envelope. I like that one. I'm just gonna put that there. Ooh, that is so cute. All right, sorry. Now, I want to do my to-do list. I'm gonna use my vanishing point, okay. I'm like so excited, I love this pen. Um, how do I do my to-do so I, I can't even remember. That's how long it's been. All right, I'm just gonna, um, mm, I want to use a line, but I don't know how far down I want to go. Cause like I said, I don't have too many things that I, I have to do. I do have a longer market list though. So, um, I need to, I want a budget. Budget um, and meal plan, that's important. Meal plan and then the market list. Okay, budget, meal plan, market list. I do want to declutter my planner area. I'm just gonna write planner area. I have like a um, a hutch that I have in my planner space and I've just been kind of shoving things in there because out of sight, just to make the house like neat and to, like all the clutter, but I kind of need to go through it now. All right, let's see, budget meal plan. Um, we need to, I want to, um, let's see, make, Yes, make tracker for Bo. Bo's been having more accidents around the house, so I want to like write down all the things that it could be, and then like what we can do to change it, and then what we do to change it, like process of elimination. So I want to make that. I need to do um, my debt. I guess snowball. We'll just snowball list. We just paid off a credit card. Um, so I had, me and Joe were talking while we were away and I'm like, well, it's due on the 7th. So instead of like saying, okay, I'm gonna add this like to the actual minimum payment of the next card, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna like go to the card that we're gonna pay off next and add another payment for the 7th. Like, I think I can do that. I gotta check. Um, I just don't know what credit card it's gonna be. Um, what else do I wanna do this week? I have laundry to do. Yay, so exciting. Laundry and then back to school. I guess checklist. I have some things that I want to do. We're working on getting like a nailing down a nighttime schedule for all of us that works really well because the kids obviously they're changing, they're older, they don't have to be in bed super early, you know, that kind of thing. So Joe and I need to come up with like our own type like schedule. And I've been trying to work on a morning routine. 
Um, what else do I need to do? I don't need to make any phone calls, which is awesome. Because we all know how much I love making phone calls. Um, what else? Budget, meal plan, market list, declutter, back to school checklist. I think that might be all. I want to make sure. Get pull tabs. And I need to research. Mustard algae. We've had it before. We got rid of it. We cannot remember if we used something or what it took to get rid of it, but <laughs> we did get rid of it. Um, and now we have it again, different pool. And I'm like, yay. So we're trying to work on that. All right, I think what I wanna do is, I think I'm just gonna go right into my market list here. Hopefully that comes up on camera. I can see it pretty good here. And get this going. And I need like everything. So we need our basics. Milk, bread, I need some butter. Yogurt, the kids yogurt. It's so funny. It's like, I've just been doing like bare minimum and I'm like, oh my goodness, we need a lot of things. <laughs> it was so funny because um, my mom was like, oh my gosh, your kids eat so much food. I'm like, yeah, they do. I'm like, why do you think I spend so much money when I'm at the market? Okay, what else do we need? We need bread. I already got that on there. We need fruit snacks. I think I want to give myself a little bit of room here, so I'm going to start up here. Um, lunch meat and pizza dough. Mommy? Hold on, Spencer. Okay, sorry about that. Spencer, she was looking for some Doritos, which I don't think we have any. I'll have to go downstairs and look. Um, corn, what else do we need? My goodness. Uh, oh, ready whip. And then we need some broccoli. I need like, I need veggies in my life. Just put brock, spinach. Corn. I love, I've been loving the corn on the cob. This, uh, this summer. I want to do some lettuce and tomatoes. I have chicken, although I think, oh, I want to get some cucumbers. Joe likes cucumbers. I think we're going to start having some salads for lunch, but like, I gotta like find some good salads. I'm not a huge fan of salads. Honey mustard, lunch meat. What else did I think? I think I got everything. Lemonade. I didn't go in order, of course, because I like to be different. Um, I think I got everything. Kids yogurt. I have, I want to get some more applesauce. Okay, and then I have other. So like cat food, tissues. To look into, so we need cat food, wet and dry. I think that what's happening with Bo is a food issue. But like I said, we're gonna make a, a list. tabs, not pods. Mm, we'll just put pods. It's fine. I need the pull tabs. Yeah, we're trying to make a list and just try to figure out what it is that um, that's bothering him. So hopefully we can figure it out because I gotta say, it's not, it's not great having a cat that's having accidents. So we shall figure it out though. I have faith 
and patience. And we've, it's been happening, I think, since, I don't know, if you guys remember, let me know down in the comments because I can't remember for sure, but I think it started in May and I probably was talking about it on here. So if you remember by some chance, <laughs> help me out and let me know. Um, Cause I'm also just trying to figure out if I changed something, like if we did something different um, like the cat boxes, for instance, those have been in the same place. I just recently moved those, hoping that that might help. Um, but it hasn't. So I'm wondering if like I, I don't know, if we did something different. Maybe, you know, I changed his food. Um, I did change the dry food, but I can't remember when that was. And... I'm not sure. It could be that. It could be giving him stomach issues. I don't know. I need help. <laughs> so we're going to probably start with food. Like Joe said, start with the food and then we'll figure it out from there. Because I was thinking it could even be like cat litter, like the texture of it. Maybe he doesn't like it. But again, you know, he was fine. And then all of a sudden, so I don't know if it's like we've hit puberty and we're gonna be a jerk <laughs> but I don't think he's being a jerk I think he has he's having trouble with something there are other opportunities that he could be a jerk and he's not so Ooh, it feels good to be back in here I do want to add something like right here but I don't know if I'm gonna need this space for anything I don't think I'm gonna but what do I want to add here a mailbox there. Can I fit it there? A mail truck. Maybe I should save these for another spread. We'll save them for another spread. They're so cute. Okay, so these were from Cece's Art Cafe. I need to, I scanned her QR code when we were there. Um, and in true form of me, fashion form, I don't know. I scanned the QR code because I'm like, I'm going to look at this later. And then I forgot. Um, but I think I still have the tab open. So if not, I could just Google it. But I'm excited to get more of these. They're so cute and the quality is so fantastic. It's so exciting um, being at the Stationery Fest because like I've been um, in the planner community mm, two and a half years now, maybe. Maybe a little bit more, I'm not sure. But um, I love that it's like, it's just for me, it's like the planner community. I was just saying to Joe when we we're talking about things and I'm like, it's so vast. Like there's so many different nooks and crannies to this community. And it's so great. Cause it's like, I think that's why it's always fresh and new for me because there are people that I discover that are new for me. Like, you know, maybe not to others, but they're new to me. And these are all new to me. Um, I've heard of Explorer, Everyday Explorers, but their, their stickers are new because I haven't had them before. And I haven't heard of Cece's Art Cafe, but so cute. Love the cats. And I'm definitely going to be checking out the artists of Yoseka to see if there are any other stickers um, for May or anybody else on there that I'm interested in. Um, so I'm really excited. It was just really nice. It was nice to see all the different things that I haven't seen before. I mean, not all of it, but some of it was. Okay, all right, anyways, let's look at this one more time. Do I have to add anything else to this? I don't think so. I'm wondering, I don't think that's gonna work up there. I was thinking about maybe putting a little piece up here, but I don't think we're gonna have the space for it. So, you know what I wanna do though? I wanna fold this. So, I don't have problems trying to pull it up again. So this time I remembered, next time I might not, but we'll try. Okay, cute, I love this. Let me know down in the comments below what your thoughts are on this. And if you are interested in subscribing to the channel, go ahead and do that now so you don't forget. Um, and hit the little bell notification so you're notified anytime we come out with something new. And if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. It helps the channel and I very much appreciate it. So thank you in advance. And I think that's gonna do it for me. I like how this came out. It feels, like I said, it feels really good to be like back into it. I'm like slowly getting back into the groove of all the things. Um, it's Monday. I, we all had a late start today. The kids have been like in loaf mode. I've been in loaf mode. 
but we're getting there. We're getting there. And I'm not like anxious or anything, but I have to say getting my planning done and being a bit this much more organized today makes me happy. So, all right, guys, if you've made it this far, thank you so much. I know we're all busy, so taking time out of your day is very much appreciated. I thank you. And um, until I see you again, have a beautiful week and keep planning. Bye.